We are at Musenga Primary School. It's in an informal settlement in Johannesburg by the name of Deep Slit. Deep Slit is an area where people have been forced to come during the apartheid time, and it was supposed to be temporary. So what's happened is that people have had to do the best they can with what they have. There is no place that, unfortunately, the residents can move. This is home. To me, though, there's a lot of hope, there's a lot of vibrancy, there's a lot of love. I cannot think of a better place that I would like to work in and make just a small bit of difference. My name is Malak Compton Rock, and I'm the founder and executive director of the Angel Rock Project and the Angel Rock Project South Africa. The work that we do is uplifting uh, vulnerable youth, mainly uh, orphan and vulnerable youth who are living either alone or with their grandmothers. There are 2,200 learners at the school. We found that the kids were desperately in need from not having enough nutrition, from not having clean and safe water, which is of course why we're here today. I think it's a pretty happy place and most importantly it's a safe space. There's a huge challenge for accessing water. Unfortunately, the majority of people live in what we call shack housing, which are metal scraps put together to form some sort of shelter. And so there's various ways that they can access water. Many schools in Deep Slit, including Masanga, rely on borehole systems. And those borehole systems are old, contaminated. They often don't get fixed. And so while a school may have water, it is not necessarily clean and it's not necessarily safe. Water is life. You know, we need water to live life. For our first phase of installation, we are installing in grades one, two, and three, and then we will move forward to install in the rest of the grades. The zero mass water panels and the way that kids are able to access water at this school is extremely humanistic and that makes me happy. They are accessing water like everybody else. The source hydro panels have brought a lot of joy to the school. The, the staff, the students are, feel really good that their lives are being invested in. Uh, the kids were able to go up to the, the panel, push the button themselves, have this water flow come out and taste it for the first time. And I mean, their, their expressions on their face basically said everything uh, to describe what it was like to have clean and safe water within their own classrooms. The other thing that's wonderful about where we placed that uh, water panel is that we are allowing grandmothers who lives within the vicinity of this school or who has grandchildren who go to this school to be able to come and get clean and safe water uh, anytime during the day when the school is open. So we had them here yesterday and it was wonderful and they were extremely, extremely grateful and just so happy. The excitement is palpable. I mean, people are blown away by what we're doing and they want to know more and I'm happy about that.